So it will be more personalized for your resume. Um, as an advice, you can try it on uh, the chat GPT. You can also edit or um, create your own words. So it will not be just um, copy and pasting. One, two, three, four. So first, um, a resume also referred to as a resume or a CV, which is uh, usually a document summarizing a person's professional and uh, academic background with your relevant skills and accomplishments. So um, it is usually used to introduce yourself and present your qualifications to a prospective employer when applying for a job. So um, all in all, um, it will serve as your presentation of yourself to the client so um just an advice guys when you are making a resume um please make sure that it will look professional so it will be their first impression to you and next is choose the right resume format so before you write a resume you need to uh, organize first your information so it will be ready and then uh, make it clear and attractive so it will increase your chances of getting interviews so um for example guys here we have a lot of VA applicants and uh, usually um uh, there were a lot of problems with regards to the resume and uh, we do understand that because um, uh, usually, um, usually ang ginagawa natin is yung pinaka-basic, pinaka-simple resume format na, na alam natin, which is we will um, discuss later kung ano ba yung proper based on the experience that we have here. So next is the chronological resume or which is typically follow a standard structure. Ito yung sinasabi namin standard structure to help um, recruiters review your information quickly. So once na they have your resume, um, they will quickly uh, see what your, like this one on the screen, your name. So first your full name. And you can make it um, a bigger on a bigger font and readable one. You can also um, add your address, your phone number, and then your email address. So um, guys, um, never forget to include on resume your phone number and email because this will be the only way our client can connect with you. So based again on our experience, we have some VA applicants na they don't attach their like their um, email or any phone number. So how come we will contact with you guys diba? if we have um a job offer or or a role na in offer ng client or in look ng client so it's really important na include natin always yung phone number and email address and then your professional summary so usually ito yung um all about ourselves um uh, we have here the uh, format the adjectives, your current job title or degree, seeking employment, a job title to apply, your, your relevant. The best example is a dependable senior graphic designer with 10 plus years of experience, responsible for daily graphic design content for a real estate company, seeking to grow professionally and uh, increase client transactions for your company. So as you can see um, from the professional summary of this applicant, based on our example, you can see na, um, uh, he have or she have a really lot of experience. And then um, it's really uh, attractive when it comes to our client na makikita nilang ganito yung start pa lang ng resume natin so we'll, they will be attractive to them.